Hello everybody, thank you so much for joining me today. So today I'm going to show you just some plants that I purchased over the past couple of months. I have been trying to be very selective in what I am buying, but I did buy a few plants. I would say like maybe six plants, seven plants maybe. But I just wanted to pop on here really quick and show you the plants that I purchased over the past couple of months. Okay, so this first plant I'm going to show you is a plant that I purchased on one of my videos, maybe a couple videos ago, where I went shopping at Lowe's and then to purchase a plant to put on my plant wall. And I purchased this plant. It is a Monstera Ansonii. It is, um, it was 1998. And I just, Thought it'd be perfect on my wall and so far it is um, I did spray it down really good with neem oil I checked the plant very well um, because I have had not so great luck with mealybugs on this plant but so far it's doing good um, it does have new growth it does sit in a bright spot back here on my plant wall and it also sits by the humidifier so I think that it's really loving that but this is um, one of the plants that I bought in the past couple of months at Lowe's. Okay, so another plant that I bought while I was at Lowe's on that same video um, is this Philodendron Mykins. And it wasn't looking so great when I bought it. But I gave it um, a little bit of water and it does sit um, on my plant wall here or on a different part of my plant wall but it gets um, pretty good light it's set far back from um, the grow light it doesn't get too much sunlight but um, it's doing good so far and I was just really happy to and surprised to see that they had this philodendron micans at Lowe's and I think this plant was like $12.98 but I picked that one up as well Okay, so this next plant I purchased at one of my favorite plant nurseries. Um, it's called Whitfield Plant Nursery. I've taken you guys um, shopping there a couple of times. I'm going to have to sh take you again because they have been re having really good plants lately. But I did buy this um, Hoya Lacnosa. And um, I think this one was like 20 bucks. And it isn't the most beautiful Hoya or um, the most stunning Hoya, but I really liked it. And so I had to pick it up. It does require more water than the normal Hoyas, the thicker leaved Hoyas, I think because it has such thin leaves. But it does sit in my south facing window and it's been doing good so far. So. That is my Hoya La Canosa. And another plant that I just purchased at um, that same um, Whitfield Nursery is this Senecio Silver Heart. And I just thought it was um, a really pretty plant. And I like the way that it um, trailed all over the place. So I picked this one up. It was $16.99. So $16.99 at that nursery. I do have this one in more bright light upstairs um, near my, like right in front of my south facing window um, because it seems like it has more succulent leaves and it just seems like it needs more light. So it is sitting up there and it's doing great so far, but I will definitely keep you guys updated on these plants. Okay, so this next plant I'm going to show you is a plant that I bought from Cactus Club. And if you guys are familiar with Ashley Anita's channel, which I'm sure you guys all are. She's such an awesome person and she does so many awesome um, plant shopping videos. But she did go to Cactus Club and at one point she, she gave us a discount code. So I use that discount code. So if you're watching my video... Ashley, thank you for that code because I did purchase a Hoya um, Macrophylla.
and I absolutely love this plant. It does have a lot of long tendrils now. It did not have these when I first purchased it. So I am hoping that it will soon grow some leaves for me. But it is such an awesome plant. I do have another one. It's a small cutting that I bought from eBay. And it has a new leaf, so I'm happy about that. But I just wanted a bigger plant. And I think this was like $40, $35, 40 something like that. Um, but I was really excited because it has a lot of um, leaves and the leaves are really healthy and it's it's really such an awesome plant and I'm hoping um, sooner than later that it will start growing some leaves for me on these tendrils but I'm really excited to have this plant so thank you again Ashley for um, showing us Cactus Club and also giving us a code so we can get a discount for to save some money on some plants. So that is my Hoya Macrophylla. Okay, so this next plant, um, I already have a cutting of this plant that I purchased from the Macari app, from somebody on the Macari app, and it is actually doing very, very well. Um, but I purchased another um, Monstera Peru and I did purchase this one from the Costa Farms website and I'm, I'm pretty happy with their website. They send out pretty quality plants. Um, the plants that I did get from them so far, um, actually it's only been these two, this one and then um, if you can see this um, Trubii Moonlight up here. Um, but it's doing very well. It has um, a lot of growth and it's getting more growth all the time, like new leaves all the time. So um, I'm happy with that purchase from Costa Farms. And then when I saw this on their website, I did purchase this one um, also. And as you can see, it has a lot of new growth. Um, it has so much new growth I'm so excited about this plant but when I did first get it it did have a few leaves that weren't looking so well um, and they did not make it but that's fine because this plant has so much new growth that it totally made up for it so I'm really happy that I have this plant these plants are really easy these um, Peru's they seem to be a pretty easy grower this one I don't even have by a lot of light and it has all this new growth. So I would say this could even be like a medium um, to maybe low light um, plant, but it's so far so good. It's growing a lot of new leaves for me and I really like the pot that it came in. So um, that is a plant that I purchased probably a couple of months ago, I'm gonna say, but um, it's doing well for me. Okay, so I have two more plants to show you they are the same plant but when I saw them I couldn't pass them up um, I did show them on my Instagram so if you follow me on Instagram um, you would have seen them I don't post a lot over there um, I'm trying to get better at it but I did post these plants so I got two string of turtles so these are plants that I have been wanting for a very long time and I just couldn't pay the money for them. Um, I didn't want to, you know, spend 50 bucks or whatever to get a string of turtles and then it die. Um, because I'm really not good with string ofs, but I'm trying to get better. I am trying to pay attention um, to their needs more. And so when I saw these string of turtles at Summer Winds Nursery, um, a local nursery near me, I had to pick them up and they had quite a few I'd say they had maybe like 10 to 12 and so I picked up these two and they were $16.99 each so $16.99 each for a six inch pot and they seem to be very healthy of course I've only had them um, now for about a week but so far so good I do have them sitting under a grow light um, about three shelves down from the grow light so they're not getting like you know scorching light but they do get um, a lot of good light 
and they seem to be doing good so far so I'm really happy with these plants and I'm even happier that they were only $16.99 so um, my string of turtles okay you guys so like I said I just wanted to pop on real quick and show you a few plants that I purchased over um, the past couple of months um, I haven't really been seeing too many plants that I like had to have and wanted to buy and like I said I am trying to be a little more selective in what I buy just because I have um, so many plants and not tons of time to take care of them but um, I'm really happy with the purchases that I made so if you guys can let me know what plant you would choose um, out of these plants that I purchased leave it in the comments down below um, I think my favorite plant that I purchased it's gonna have to be the string of turtles because um, like I said I've been wanting this plant forever and when I saw it for $16.99 in such healthy condition I couldn't pass it up so I'm gonna have to go with the favorite plant that I bought um, out of these plants that I just showed you is gonna have to be the string of turtles but I really do love all the plants that I purchased I just want to thank you guys so much for watching if you want to see more plant videos from me don't forget to give this video a thumbs up also don't forget to subscribe to my channel so you don't miss a video when I post and I just want to thank you guys so much for watching and until next time guys bye